Hi there, my name is Filip Danieka. I am CEO at FlatLogic and I want to briefly present you our platform. With FlatLogic, you can easily create, deploy and develop web applications in just a few steps. So let me show you how to do it. I click on the start web application on the main page. On the next page, I choose a technology stack. Let it be Vue, Node.js and PostgreSQL. I type application name. I click next. On the next page, I choose a template, which will be material one. I like material design. On the next page, I uh, define a database schema. Uh, in other words, tables and relations between them. I can choose from a list of available examples. So I choose a bookstore and will build uh, further upon this uh, schema. So it has users, books, and tags. I click next. On the next page, I connect my application to a GitHub repository. FlatLogic bot is going to create this repository in your GitHub and push all the necessary code there. So let's click create and wait a bit. Okay, so the repository is ready and all code is there. So let's take a look at the code. Here is it, FlatLogic bot made a commit. Okay, I'm finishing this um, setup process. So that's the application page. That's the URL of the application. I can click on the deploy button and FlatLogic platform is going to create a live preview of your application for you. It also takes a few minutes. So let's wait here. So your application is ready. It's uh, ready to use full stack view application connected to the database. Here you see a list of entities, they are users, books, and tags. You can create, delete, and list them and modify them, of course. You can access the API if you want to access the uh, data of your app remotely from third-party applications. Uh, okay, now let's take a look what happens if we want to add another table. For example, we want to add a categories table to our application. I go to the schema editor, type table name. Uh, I define a new field called name. I specify all the required columns here. It's of type string. I click save and I once again click save to save the entire database schema. Then I click push to GitHub and FlatLogic bot will create a new commit in your repository. This commit will contain all the required changes and uh, will contain new classes for the created entities and for made changes. So no need to write code for, for you. Okay, all we need to do is to simply merge this code to the master branch because the deployment takes place from the master branch. Let's merge. Okay, so the pull request is merged. So all the code is in master branch now. Let's go back to our live preview. Uh, here we need to click on the deploy from Git button. It will regenerate live preview of the application for us. Let's wait a bit. Okay, so here is your application, it's ready, but now it contains categories table. Also, the data from the previous example is consistent, so there is no need to worry for a database for you. Okay, let's go back to the platform and take a look at another scenario. For example, I want to create a clean React application with Create React app. So let's type the name, I don't know, my app, choose React and choose no backend. Click next. Choose Create React App Template, uh, connect to GitHub repository. I don't know, I have maybe my app, but let's my app one. It creates a repository and generate a demo for the front end only React application. Let's wait a bit. Okay, so here is it. Your application is ready. You can work with the code in GitHub repository and push changes from there to our platform. Uh, basically, that's it about FlatLogic. If you want to dive deeper, please take a look at our documentation. We have covered all the necessary and important parts there. Well, that's it. And thank you.